Hi, this video tutorial I will cover how to store a user defined object in Java array. Here you can see the array which contains 5 employee objects and length of the array is 5. This is first index, this is last index and in index position 3 employee object 4 is there. Array is a container object that holds a fixed number of elements of a single type and length of the array is established when the array is created. After creation, the length of the array is fixed, we cannot change and each item in an array is called an element and each element is accessed by its numerical index. We will see one example now. Here I have defined uh, employee class and it has uh, name, age and salary and it has uh, employee constructor which accept uh, name, age and salary and using this constructor we can create uh, employee object and I have defined uh, getter and setter methods for name, age and salary. And uh, here I have overridden a uh, toString method and uh, this method will return employee information. Here I have declared uh, array demo class. It has a main method. First I will run this program then I will explain. This is output of uh, this sample program. Here I have created uh, employee array and uh, this employee array can store 5 employee objects and uh, here I am initializing uh, first employee object here I am initializing uh, second employee object like that uh, I am initializing uh, 5 employee objects then uh, using for each loop I am getting uh, each employee object from uh, employee array and uh, displaying the employee and uh, here you can see the output and uh, this is about uh, how to store uh, user defined objects in uh, Java array. And uh, thanks for watching.